There's the ball, and here's Les Kiter. All right, Vern, Cassius Clay backs away from a wild left hand. Nobody's swung, uh, landed a punch. Clay in his white trunks, black stripe. William's black trunks, white stripe. Clay about two pounds heavier. They're of a size and height, about six, two and a half, six, three. Clay is going through that famous shuffle of his. William's stalking him, moving clockwise right above our mutual mic. Williams dances, uh, shoots a light left jab that misses. Clay just shuffles, has his hands down, pulls up his pants, tight. Keeps shuffling, now he's going counterclockwise and weaving, bobbing. Clay has yet to throw a punch. Williams has missed two light jabs. That's it so far in the first 30 seconds. Cleveland Williams, the big cat, the man who throws bombs, throws a light left jab. Clay backing away off the ropes above us. Clay with his hands down, now moving clockwise. Continuing in that same shuffle of his, he's got, uh, he looks like a dancer up there, or the way he pops and weaves for a man 212 pounds, he ducked under a left hand thrown by Williams, landed in top of the head. Actually, knew the man has thus far been hit. Williams uh, stalking his man, Cleveland outwardly very calm. They call him the big cat, and he throws bombs. Here's Clay's first punch of left to the body, light left. Clay, moving in now, left, straight left, jolting jab to the jaw. Cleveland Williams just stalking him as Clay is moving around, throws a light left to the head. And another left taken on the glove by Cleveland Big Cat Williams, who's the popular favorite here in Houston in the afternoon tonight. Clay throws a right, and it doesn't seem to bother Williams at all. Williams right above our microphone, has Clay in the corner, hits him right to the body. Clay maneuvers deftly and gets out of the corner. That's one of those things that people are waiting to say. If he can corner Clay, Clay on the shovel comes into the left of the body, lands a left to the head, a hard left to the face, thrown by Cassius Clay. And it's Clay with the heavier punches so far. Clay with that jolting jab. Williams keeps at him, takes another hard left that stands his hair on end. But Clay's left to the nose again. Clay with a missing left to the body. Clay has shown he has that devastating left jab. And he lands again. Williams stalking him upon us, takes a right on his glove, thrown by Clay. Clay's best punch so far, the only one really the left here is the left by Williams. Clay's head went back and the crowd roared, but it didn't have too much effect. Williams shoots a left jab at Clay, moving clockwise in the shuffle, constantly. Takes a left in the face, throws a right to the ear of Williams. A combination left and right by Clay, both in the glove. There's a left in the face of Williams. Clay has landed the harder punches. Clay with a left to the nose, a right to the nose. And Clay shakes him up, goes into a shuffle, misses a left, throws a left and a right. Williams stands his ground in mid-ring, but is taking punches and punishment. It's all Clay landing. Clay, left to the face, a little left hook thrown by Clay. Williams not hurt at all, but he's taken the heavier blows. We have 20 seconds left in round one. Here's Williams now, has yet to land a solid punch on Cassius Clay. Clay in his bob and weave against the ropes, left the body, left to the face, and that combination of one-two, left the body, and a short left jump by Williams, but Clay backing up. Everyone waiting to see if Cleveland can land the bomb. He may never get the chance. He takes the left to the nose. The bell, the end of round one. Williams proved he could take a punch. But Clay jarred him. It was all Cassius Clay. There's the bell. Here's this. Harry Kessler, the referee in the last heavyweight title fight. He did Marciano and Moore, one of the great respected officials. Clay, who has dazzling speed with that left hand, and he shows it to Williams with the left hook. Now the left hook taken in the glove by Williams. Cleveland wants to get in that one big left hook. Everyone waiting. He has yet to really throw a bomb. Here's Clay landing a hard left taken in the glove, however, by Cleveland Williams. And there's Williams with the left of the nose. Clay ducked and then backpedaled away. Clay shuffling, shoots a left off the shovel, is pushed into Williams' corner, and cuts Williams with the left hand to the ear. Williams stalking his man, looks more ready to throw punches than he was in the first round. Here's Clay missing with a light left to the body. Clay's jabbing with his left hand, a snapping left jab to the nose. Williams' nose will be sore tomorrow, that's for sure. Here's Clay bobbing, weaving. Williams keeps stalking him, throws the left, but Clay backs against the rope. Here's Williams with Clay against the rope. Definitely Clay ducks under the rope, ducks his head and catches the right. Williams with a left and the crowd roared. He didn't hurt him, but he did land on Clay. Clay actually got his head under the top ring strand. Here's a left to the body by Clay. Williams keeps moving in, takes a left thrown by Clay and a slap by Clay. Clay hits you in many different ways. Slaps and hooks and jabs. Dazzling speed, left to the nose. Williams has him against the ropes above us, but Clay definitely ducks. Takes a short, jolting left to the top of the head. Williams unable to follow through. Takes the left thrown by the champion. Clay with another left. Clay can hit him almost at will with his left jab. But Williams not rocked. Takes another left to the nose. The nose bleeding. That's a right hook to the eye by Cassius Clay off the left hook. Clay with a, Clay with a left jab. Some clear flowing from Williams' nose, but it bothers him not one whit. Here's Williams throwing the right, but Clay ducked. Clay ducked over the ring to the top rope and got away from the first bomb. Here's Clay with a combination left, right, left, catching Williams. 
his hair up on end again and strikes up to the left to the nose. Another one, another one, a right to the arm. Williams mad. Storms after Clay who backs away and cuts him to the left. Williams is tied up by Clay and a referee's hold, a wrestler's hold in the corner, but they break left to the body, Clay. Clay ducks, doesn't throw. Williams faints, doesn't throw. Clay cuts him with a couple of light lefts as he backs away, weaving clockwise a hard left from the right to the nose. Williams down to the right. He's up at two, but he'll take a mandatory eight count. A short joining right hook by Clay, and Cleveland Williams was down. He doesn't look hurt. He's taking the mandatory eight. We have a knockdown in round two. Here comes the champion, throws another right, misses the left, throws the right. He's got Williams hurt in mid ring. Clay with a left, a right, a left. Williams with his back to us is getting hit. It's well, a left, a right. Clay has him going down on his sitting down above us. He gets up immediately. He'll take another mandatory eight. Clay threw both hands up in the air, signal of victory. But Kester is giving the mandatory eight. Williams shakes his head. Williams has been hurt. We have 12 seconds left in the round. A left misses by Williams. Williams will survive the round. A right, a left by Clay, a left to the right, and Williams plowing his back, but the bell will ring, but they'll keep counting. The bell, and he keeps counting, and Kessler says, no, the round is over. They told us that the count would continue. Williams was flat on his back. Kessler called the end of round two, with Williams down at the count of two. There's the bell, and here's Les Carter. We'll go away, it may not last long. Williams gets hit with a left. He has no, nothing to lose now, but to throw bombs. He's been down three times. Takes a right short by Clay. Clay hitting him almost at will. Williams with that age apparently slowing him up. And he's a target here at the left and a right by Clay. Backing away, goes into a shuffle. A right, left, right by Clay, a left. Williams trying to protect himself, can't do it. Left to the face, a left and a right. Williams down, he may not get up. Two, three, he's over in Clay's corner. He does get up at five, wobbling. This is the fourth knockdown. Mandatory eight count, and he now is... Bleeding at the mouth, there he is up. Clay goes after him. Clay has a target now. Four knockdowns already. He's hitting with a barrage of left and right. Left, right, left. It's all Clay. Williams now jabs a little bit, but no effect. Throws another jab. Clay feels he's got him now. Cuts him on the back of the ear and almost knocked him down. But Williams now stand up style, backing away. Clay hits him with a left to the face. Williams doesn't quite know what to do. He's been hurt. Badly takes a left and a right in his own corner, right, and the referee stops the fight. It's all over. Clay wins by a technical knockout in round number three. The time, one minute, 51 seconds. Harry Kessler stops the fight. The winner by a technical knockout and still heavyweight champion of the world, Cassius Clay. And now the ring is suddenly full of people. They haven't made the announcement, but Williams was obviously defenseless in his own corner at 151 of round three.